Farming is a kind of a, a fight against the, the weather all the time. I'm Marc Lafleche. I'm the Lef on the Lafleche farm. Uh, I have uh, dairy, soybean, and corn on my farm. We, our family farming is farming since uh, the late 40s on uh, in St. Albert. I grew up on the farm with my three brothers. It was a nice lifestyle. Farming by the outside looks uh, very peaceful, uh, but uh, it's uh, really challenging because one of the challenges on my farm is to keep the moisture on my, on my soil during the summertime. On springtime, we have a lot of water on the soil, but it's mostly during the summer that uh, we're looking to keep the water uh, in the soil. That's why I asked uh, Mark to come at my place for a solution for my problem. How are you today? Good, how are you? So let me show you the field. Yeah, I love to see it. But how big are your fields on your farm here? Oh, I have fields that are almost uh, 50 acres. And now we grow corn, soybean, and also I have uh, hay on my farm. So I see you have some really nice flat fields out here. It's very flat. During the spring, it's, it's very, very wet. But with the tile drainage I installed in the early 80s, it's worked very good. That does the job, yeah. Yeah, it does the job, but since the last five years, I have about three years that we have drought during the summertime. Is there a solution to keep the moisture on, the, on my ground? With your flat fields out here and the ditch back there and your fields tile drained, I would uh, recommend controlled tile drainage as a, as a practice to put on your farm. And that involves uh, installing a structure at your outlet and what it does is it conserves water when you need it. So during the summertime when you get a rainfall and those crops could really use that water, rather than that water draining out down the drain, you can conserve that water and allow your crops to utilize that. And so that's a control structure at the edge of, the air, edge of your field. It acts like a dam and so it keeps the water in the fields but it also allows the excess water to drain out. So you're not gonna waterlog your, your crops either. And so we've seen benefits, great benefits with crop yields uh, by capturing that moisture, sometimes up to 10% in corn or soybean. That's good. Yeah, it is good. And so it's, a, it's an easy practice. It's easy thing to install, especially because you already have tile drainage uh, and it just involves installing a structure at the outlet. Uh, you just use it with the, install it with the backhoe. Okay, is that expensive? It's about $1,200 maybe with the backhoe and everything, and you have, and that'll cover about 10 acres. Yeah, okay, that's good. Yeah, and so uh, it's, it's beneficial, and the other good thing about controlled tile drainage is that it's good for the environment. Okay. Because one of the other benefits of controlled tile drainage is that it keeps the nutrients in the fields rather than draining out into the environment. So you're doing a great thing for the future uh, generations by helping the environment. The environment is very important for me as a farmer. I want to improve my farm It's because I want to uh, increase profit, have better crops, and uh, eventually uh, make a better future. My goal is to make my farm better than when I bought it, and controlled tile drainage is going to help achieve that.